Hi, welcome to Section 4, Secure Authentication. In this section, you will learn how to use HTTPS to provide secure login from an OpenLayers app to your GeoServer-based services. You'll learn about the building blocks of our proxy platform, Apache HTTPD and Tomcat, and how to configure them. Next, we'll cover HTTPS and TLS, and you'll learn how to generate certificates to enable secure requests. You'll learn about GeoServer's user access permissions to permit authorized users to access the server. Finally, we'll test out a secure login with curl and an OpenLayers web app. Let's get started by configuring the proxy environment. A proxy server is widely used to provide a secure means of authentication to the GeoServer instance on Tomcat. In this video, you'll learn about the main components of the example proxy environment, Apache HTTPD and Tomcat. You'll learn how to configure these to provide secure authentication. Finally, you'll learn to use the host file to facilitate the TLS process. The Apache HTTP server, HTTPD for short, is the most popular web server in use. Putting HTTPD in front of Tomcat is useful since we can potentially leverage a larger assortment of modules and their capabilities, take advantage of load balancing, and the larger body of documentation. After Apache is correctly installed and started, the default page is available at localhost. I used one of the packages available out there on the web. This one is for Windows to install Apache rather than build it myself. This has the benefit of having many modules pre-built and also comes with the open SSL executables that we'll use to produce the certificate in the next video. To configure Apache, check out the httpd.conf file under the conf directory where Apache is installed. httpd.conf is well commented and relatively easy to read. The configuration syntax is usually referred to as directives. This section of the httpd.conf file shows modules that are loaded with httpd. We will need to make sure that we're adding a few modules for secure proxy authentication. Mod proxy AJP instead of the older mod JK module. That takes care of the AJP connection to Tomcat and mod SSL. And you'll find these modules listed somewhere in this list and just make sure to uncomment them, assuming that they've already been built for the package that you're using. The httpd file includes some conditional directives for loading modules. So if the SSL module has been included, then these directives are run. One of them is including this separate conf file, which we'll be configuring in the next video. We'll use Tomcat as the servlet container rather than the default embedded jetty. This is a well-documented configuration to use Tomcat with Apache httpd. It is necessary to set the Catalina underscore home environment variable to the base directory of Tomcat. If you don't see an obvious error message on the Tomcat startup, you'll know that this environment variable needs to be set. To install GeoServer on Tomcat, download a .war .war file from the GeoServer site and move it into the web apps directory. It should be expanded into the familiar directory structure when Tomcat is run with the war for the first time. If this fails, you may need to check your privileges. The main configuration for Tomcat is the server.xml file under Tomcat's conf directory. The main thing we need to pay attention to is the AJP connector. Here you can see the connector is listening at port 8009. This will be important as we complete proxy configuration in the next video. Before we do that, let's take a look at the host file. In Windows, this is available under the path that you see in the heading. In Linux, it is usually under the etc directory, etc directory. This file allows you to map a host name to an IP address. You can see here the familiar local host is mapped to our local IP address, and that's how that works on the OS. I've added the host name hello.world, and I'll be using this throughout the section. But you may want to set a host name here that is equivalent to your web host if you want to do local testing. 